Hi, with this movie I'm going to show some of the basic functionality of 3D Surveyor. If you're doing a simple survey, uh, then you're probably working in 2D mode or 2.5D mode. You're really looking at uh, you're looking at your survey from the top down. So that's what I have on the screen at the moment, is a simple survey. Doesn't look like much at the moment, but you'll see in a second that will change. Now if I'm connected to Total Station to this, then if I want to add more points, I just go to my data collection line here and I say which layer I want to add and I want to add a line and then I just press the play button and it will automatically add more points, more lines in this case, into my survey. Uh, and everything you do appears on the screen in real time. Now what 3D Surveyor also does is I can change my views. So for example here I have a survey that as I said doesn't look like much at the moment but if I change my view to 3D mode, which is the view button is the upper left corner, I'm now in 3D mode, and you'll see that I can rotate my survey in 3D. There I have my building. Now the tripod in the center of the screen is my total station position, and the green line is pointing to my reference object, so that's oriented the instrument. So I'm rotating around the instrument position now. I can zoom in closer. It's like rotating a plate. So by moving the mouse up and down, I can change my position. Now I can also change uh, to more views. So if I press the view button again, this is the view for the total station position at the moment. So right now it's pointing basically straight up but I can actually see my survey in there. But What I'll do is one more press and this is my eye view. So this is standing at the at the total station. I can now rotate around my survey. And if I decide to add more, I can add more just by firing the instrument. If I press the forward arrow here, I can also fly through these doors and windows if I want to and get a closer look. I can do that. So let's go through that door. And I'll just turn around to look back at my survey. And there you can see the total station sitting there in my room. And data can be collected in this view just as easily as it is in the 2D view. And that's a, a basic run-through of some of the functionality in 3D Surveyor.